and gentlemen, that is our uh, broadcast colleague from Monday Night Raw, Mr. CM Punk. King, did you know he was around? So why not bring my friend CM Punk out here? Oh, now you got your friends. Oh, we've been friends for a long time. You were telling me last week you couldn't stand the guy. Yeah, I was talking about you. There he is, finally. How you doing? Hey, buddy. How you doing tonight? You gonna join us? Charles Montgomery Punk, good to see you. You want to come on. It might be a little sweaty. Oh, God. So, uh, Mr. Punk is joining us here at ringside tonight uh, at the announce table. And by the way, he called you Charles Montgomery. I thought the CM game stood for a coal miner. It does. Okay. Oh, well, that's man. why that's why he's out. He's, he's gone, and I'm here. But you couldn't, <laughs> you couldn't stay away from the main event, the chairs match, could you? No, no, no. I'm very excited. Easier said than done, Michael Cole. On his own. What do you think, Punk? <laughs> I'm not sure if Wayne Bear can do it on his own. I'm not sure if John Cena can do it on his own. That's exactly why these men can use a chair on each other. Give him a huge advantage. I don't think he was trying to run away. I think he was trying to even the score here. Cena, the culmination of a just an unreal year, an unbelievable year in many ways. Well, you said he had a horrible year, didn't you? Yeah, he did. Yeah. Think about it. I yeah. can't think of anybody better suited to have a horrible year. He was beaten up by Nexus Brain. Well, and you gotta wonder why Cena's doing that. Cena's trying to keep the chairs away from Barrett. I believe Cena wants to hurt Barrett with his own hands. Good. Doesn't he? Good. Good. Careful, guys. Why do they always gotta come over here? Exactly. John Cena able to move out of the way two times. Let's see if the third time's the charm here. Oh. By oh. Wade Barrett. Oh, look at him. Now he's running away from Wade. He's not running away. He's trying to equalize. I think he's done enough damage to Nexus for one night with the chair. I don't think he should be allowed to use the chair. It's a chair match. I, I understand that, but that, the, the man's a, he's barbaric enough. You don't put a weapon in that man's hands. Oh, Kick oh, right man. to his face. If he can't beat Wade Barrett. Well, he, he'd still have his job, whereas uh, a couple of weeks ago he did not work here. A match like this is so dangerous, as I'm sure you're well aware of, Michael Cole. I see him running away again. Doesn't seem to be any running away. Oh, oh man! Right to the back. There are chairs everywhere. There's a huge dent in that one chair that Wade Barrett just smashed over the back of John Cena. To figure out what Barrett's trying to do here. He's trying to win. Come on. He's trying to hurt John Cena. He's trying to maim John Cena for everything that John Cena has put him through over the last six months. I'm the sanest man out here would be enough. Where's Cena going now? I think I think Cena just left. I don't think that chair is legal. Now both these men are going to oh, be feeling well. this in the morning. <laughs> Wade Barrett is just one wasteland away from embarrassing John Cena. I guess technically this is a submission on chairs, man. It's these people, Cole. These people seem to feed John Cena. They seem somehow give him Watch energy. Should dock Cena a day's pay for napping on the job right now. That was a double. I think I think Wade can can hit a home run. Oh, I thought it was all over there. Justin. Now, yeah. Earlier when John was tied up, Barrett was pointing at the Nexus armband, telling him it could have been you. This all could have been avoided. All John Cena had to do was cooperate with Wade Barrett. He could have been a member of Nexus, the most powerful group in the WWE, and everything would have been fine. Come on, Punk. He was a member. He had to go get coffee. Then he had the coffee thrown on him. He was humiliated at every point and turn. Now the world needs ditch diggers too, King. Don't look at me like that, Michael Cole. Show some mercy, John Cena. For the past well, then he should turn the other cheek. I don't like vindictive people. I'm sure John Cena didn't like it when it was happening to him. And look what... I'm not going to say Wade Barrett doesn't deserve it. I'm just saying John Cena deserves it that much more. This guy's been ruining people's lives for years. John Cena? Yes. Well, he's about to ruin Wade Barrett's life. Yes, he is. This is not a good situation. Chairs. This is vindictive. It's unnecessary. It's unnecessary. His shoulder. That was the damnedest attitude adjustment I've ever seen. Completely unnecessary. But at what cost? I mean, Wade, Wade Barrett's a broken man. He's crawling on all fours away from the ring. Whoa, 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 wait a second. We may, we may not have now, wait that. a second. The match is over. Everything that Nexus the has The match is over. Cena. I don't want to hear anything about anything anybody's done to John Cena. This is think, barbaric. I just don't think John it's Cena. It's cruel and unusual. I don't think Cena wants to see... What well, how far is he going to go? The match is over. He's won. It's over. It is over. The bell rang. Uh, is he going to chase him all the way back to the locker room? The man is crawling on all fours.
he pulled, he pulled the set down. He pulled the set down on top of a human being. Wade Barrett does not deserve this. No call for this. Wade Barrett, look at this. He's disgusting. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, Happy you're welcome.